Welcome to the Cal Corporation's series of videos about software engineering. The topic of this video is trailing return types. Before proceeding, make sure that you have already watched these other videos first. This templated function has a generic return type. If you call add to by passing an unsigned care, then template parameter T gets specialized to be unsigned care, and that is what the return type will be. But recall that C++ has a rule that when you have addition of two unsigned care operands, they get promoted into an int before applying this addition operator. So the type of this addition is int but the type of the return is unsigned care, meaning it's possible there could be overflow if the sum's value happens to be too big to fit in an unsigned care. A more precise programming of the return type that we want would use decal type to say return whatever type is needed for this kind of addition. That works because decal type does correctly take any integer promotion into account. However, you cannot write your function definition this way because at the time the compiler is trying to understand your specification of a return type, that AXVAR parameter is not yet in scope. For this situation, C++11 invented the trailing return type syntax. Don't be confused by this reuse of the auto keyword. This is not a type shortcut from return statement. This time, the auto keyword is merely saying that the return type specification is delayed until after the arrow symbol 